From the 28th to the 31st will be DLSL's first annual Bullying Awareness Week, representing these new beautiful t-shirts. Luke, what do these t-shirts represent? Well, Chris, as this is the back of your shirt, I really like how you're wearing it. Thank you. I really do. Now, we're going to look to support for targeted individuals. Next, we're going to look for light for those in the dark. And finally, hope for survivors. Also, we're going to look to teach and advocate to break the cycle. All sports teams will have their own custom bowling awareness t-shirts or jerseys. And if you purchase one of these, only for $20, you will be allowed at every single event and for free, wearing your shirt. And pilots, tonight, Tuesday night against U of D, come watch Fast Money Joe and wear your new Bull Stop Prevent Bowling t-shirts. It's going to be a blowout. The place is going to be packed. Mr. Watson, make some extra space for the bro zone because we're coming hot. And we're going to have an ESPN table live there. Just wait. <laughs> And pilots, you can get your very own Stop Bullying t-shirt for only $20. See Mr. Widows or look in the pilot hanger for more information about They're being this. sold throughout the whole month of January. So make sure you get yours fast before they sell out. I'm here live at the Lincoln Memorial with Tony Serra. Tony, <laughs> how has your experience on March for Life been so far? Ooh, my experience on March for Life, it's the best time I've ever had so far. Yesterday, we, we marched uh, to go against abortion. Great time, had an awesome time. Today, we're, uh, we're touring the, the city of Washington, D.C. and it's unbelievable. Right here is the Lincoln Memorial, and behind us is the Washington Monument. It's awesome. Yeah. Tony, rumor has it you got to see President Donald Trump yesterday. That is, is that true, true? Oh. very true. And a uh, fun fact, um, I said I love you to him, and he said he loves me back. He did talk to me. It's crazy, Tony, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Luke! Yes, sir. What did you draw up for your segment this week? What did you piece together? Chris, I gave everyone an inside look on De La Salle's new stained glass window. A special donor has donated a new stained glass window to go in our very own chapel. Yeah. What is this kid talking about? Yeah. Are you serious? Yes. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Dude, they donated like 40k just for a stained glass window. I don't believe you. I guess we're going to find out. Because I have not heard this before. All right, pilots, let's check in to hear about your new stained glass window going in the chapel. And they have to check out, really, the inside of what the new window is going to look like. So let's go take a look at that, Chris. Chris, there were some interesting sports updates this week. Was there? Yeah, let's uh, check in with Jack and see how those went. Thanks, Luke. Welcome back, guys, to another sports update. Today, we're going to start with basketball and had a record of 9-2 and, and a devastating loss recently to St. Mary's with a score of 56-65. to Today, at 7, at De La Salle, we will be playing our rivals, U of D. Make sure you're there. Let's talk about swimming now. With a record of two and three, there's going to be a county meet at Lance Cruz North at 11 a.m. Come watch our wrestling team take on CC Wednesday at 5.30 p.m. at the BRAC. Let's talk lacrosse now. Lacrosse workouts will begin after school 3 to 4 p.m. every Tuesday and Thursday at De La Salle. Also, trials March 7 at De La Salle, 7 to 9 p.m. Hope you're there. Let's make this a good season. Jason, let them know. I'm not under the weather anymore, so uh, he's coming back and doing the weather. Let's check in with Meriwether and Phone to see what's going on. This place is bright, man. I know. It's well, good day, my great audience. Are you happy? Because I sure am. Most of this week is going to be partly cloudy, with fair temperatures going up to the mid-30s. Really not a bad week at all. Of course, it snows this weekend, but hey, let's live in the moment. Uh, as always, wear your jackets. Bundle up, but don't bundle up too well, because it's above freezing this week. With all that said, my name is Meriwether. Back to you, Chris and Luke. Once again, Kyle did not have a segment, so... Chris, well, let's support him. Kyle, we hope you can do something next week. And we're really going to encourage to motivate you to be better. Because, Chris, you got to remember, 
fully free. Speak up, man. Stop You're right. being so mean to him all the time. You're right. Kyle, I got your back. Kyle, we got you. So next week, we're going to help you out with your segment. Pilots, make sure you tune in next week to see a very special edition. What's that edition? Kyle did a segment edition. No way. That's crazy. Crazy eight. All right, and we hope to see you next week, and that's all.